Hi guys, in this video, we're gonna look at how to generate a character turnaround sheet like this. Getting a character sheet will be really helpful for creating consistent characters because now you know what the same character looks like from all different angles. And this is a tool that can make your work much faster and more creative. The keyword in this video is again composition reference. If you've seen the video of using a card design sheet, it's the same keyword. Without any reference, Here's the prompt, and let's generate a few pictures. We're getting pretty good results. All these characters are pretty ready to use. Trick number one is we can put something in the style reference. This is the image I'm using. I'm trying to give it a bit more fancy night type of look. I think the influence strength was too high for that. So let's try to lower it. You see, it looks like it's pretty hard to find a good balance. If I want to use an image as a reference, it seems like I just can't get my prompt working properly like this anymore. Here's where our character turnaround sheet comes into play. And let's just turn off the style reference for now and see. These are some of the stuff we got. The thing about using a character turnaround is your generations are gonna have the same figure as what's on your turnaround sheet. So we do need to try to look for a turnaround sheet with the desired figure. Now let's turn on the style reference. Okay, as soon as we started using the style reference, we're not getting the half-naked medieval warrior anymore we have the armor on but i feel like the style reference is a little bit too strong so it's affecting the background so i'm gonna lower the style influence with this one i'm getting a pretty good result with the same settings sometimes it's it's very funky it can it can get a bit uh, like horror movie like where the legs this is trial and error. Also, keep in mind that you should try to find the best turnaround sheets for your character. Like, if you want a goblin, don't use a tall character turnaround sheet unless you want a tall goblin, but that's not really a goblin. But you get the idea, it's really just find a sheet, throw it into composition reference, and create. 